Now let's try to write equation for a polynomial given some conditions. In this part, we will write equation of a polynomial given zeros and y-intercept. So let's have a look at this problem. Write equation of a quartic function that has zeros at minus 3, minus 1 of order 2 and 2 over 3 and y-intercept of minus 18. Okay, so we'll do this. Now, what is a quartic function? Quartic function has degree of 4. So, we need a polynomial of degree 4. We are given three particular zeros and one is of order 2. So, of course, we have zeros which does satisfy the condition. What is not known to us is the value of a. We will get a family of functions from here. And in general, that family of function can be written as f of x equals to a times this root x plus 3. So if I write x plus 3, I have I have this 0 at x equals to minus 3, correct? This 0 is at minus 1. Therefore, the factor should be x plus 1. Note, this 0 is of order 2. Therefore, the degree will be 2 here. How about this? This will be 3x minus 2. Now see, why 3x minus 2? You want a 0 at 2 over 3. Now, if you equate 3x minus 2 equals to 0, you get 0 at 2 over 3. The other way to look into this fraction is like this. 0 will be at x minus 2 over 3. Correct? Now, this is equal to 3x minus 2 over 3. Correct? So that's the numerator part which gives you 0. Correct? That's what we got here. So, we have a function which is a times x plus 3 times x plus 1 whole square 3x minus 2. The zeros are satisfied. Minus 3, minus 1 of order 2 and this one 2 over 3. Now, y intercept of minus 18. This helps us to determine exactly the equation of the function. If this condition is not given to us, we will end up with family of functions with common zeros. Okay? Now, y-intercept is always at x equals to 0. Therefore, f of 0 is equals to a. We will replace this x with zeros. And solve for a. f0 is y-intercept given as minus 18. Minus 18 equals to a times 3, 1 square is 1, and 0 minus 3 is minus 2, which is 3 times 2, 6. So minus 6a equals to minus 18. So what is a equals to? a equals to minus 18 divided by minus 6. So we get a equals to 3. Therefore, our function is fx equals to 3 times x plus 3, x plus 1, whole square, 3x minus 2. Correct? Let's try to graph it. How does it look like? So, where are the zeros? Zeros are at minus 3, minus 1. Okay, let's say this is my minus 1. Then this is minus 2 and this is my minus 3. So these are my zeros, okay? And at 2 over 3. 2 over 3 is less than 1. So, let's be put it like this. 2 over 3. So, this is my 2 over 3. The order of the zero is, see, leading coefficient is positive and it's a 4 degree. Therefore, the end behavior will be going up, correct? Both sides up. So here we should cross like a line because it is of order 1. Here we should turn like a parabola, degree 2. And here we should cross like a line. And if we connect these two, we should get our graph, right? So let's connect them.
So that's the parabola fx for which the conditions were given to us and there you can confirm zeros at minus 3 minus 1 of order 2 and at 2 over 3 correct and this value is what y intercept and this should be minus 18 I hope you get it correct thank you